of all the things that you can ask for. I mean, I bet you, let us pick up a slay queen here. Let us pick up a six-pack boy here and let God look at you and say, what do you want? I bet you trips to Dubai will be sourced for. GTIs will be ordered. Bentley's ghosts will be ordered. Shades and glasses and houses and mansions will be mentioned. Clothes that are matching will be mentioned. Glasses and an inexhaustible black card in the bank so that we can swipe and buy as long as... But Solomon looks at God and says, I, I have everything. You guys are missing it, man. When you are poor, your prayers are equivalent to your poverty. But when you have everything, you may just start desiring other things that are outside of materials. You can't make your prayer lives material begging sessions in the corridors of grace. I want a car. I want a house. I want school fees. I want a husband. I want a wife. What have made you think that God runs a material supply shop? Those that are above materials start making requests that are on the other realm. What do you want? Can't touch it. I want wisdom. And God looks at him and says, because you asked for wisdom. Ah, over and above the wisdom. You, 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 you ask for the master key. He does not come alone. You didn't hear me, guys. When you make requests, ask for those things that have partners. If you are following me, you can hear where I'm going. You can hear where I'm going. If you are making requests, don't ask for those things. If you get a car, you just get a car. Actually, a car is, doesn't, a, car is a problem because you need maintenance, you need fuel, you need other things. It will take away even what you are given. But the other things, when they come, they have extra stuff that follows them. I want wisdom. God says, above wisdom, I will give you. I'll give you wealth, money. Therefore, money is not superior to wisdom. In fact, you don't need a husband. You need wisdom. How to get him. You don't need a house. You need wisdom on how to get the damn house you're praying for. You don't need that. You need this. Because when you got this, it will assist you with the software to get that. Unfortunately, many of us are not focusing at this. We are focusing at that. And when that comes, in the absence of this, we are still in a mess than we were when we did not have those things. That's why many people who win lotto, many people who win lotto money, they are poorer after they win the money than they were before they received the money. Because money without knowledge, money without wisdom, is a flipping mess. A marriage without knowledge and wisdom is a torture room. Education without morality. You end up in prison having stolen people's monies. Because they make you an accountant, they give you a signature to sign. You look at the money and say, oh, this is mine. It's not yours. You're at work in China. Therefore, you pray for books, you pray for knowledge, you pray for all these things. I want, you know, I want can I graduate? Can I graduate? By the time you graduate, you are two months away from prison and you don't even know it. Oh.